What up everyone, this is Stogie Homies in the mix, coming live from the 905. My name is Say, this is Tito. What are we smoking on today, my brother? Today we're smoking our homies, our crew's favorite top pick, the Ken Alec and Bradley Kintsugi. Uh, the Kintsugi is a Japanese art uh, where, they, where they bring, instead of throwing away the broken vase and glass, uh, they glue it back together with a golden gold lacquer um, and bring its value back. Go with the cut and light. You want the V cut because I like the V. You know what I'm saying? I'm a lead. But I like the V. One, two, three. Bam. Simple. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying anymore. There you go. Ooh, it already smells good. Mm, 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 mm. It's right. Off the light, first thing I, the first thing it reminds me of is Arizona iced tea. I don't know if y'all grew up drinking Arizona iced tea, but that used to be 99 cents. I know right now it's a dollar twenty nine. And tells they price you three dollars and something. Some BS right there, but right there. I mean, I mean, my first impression, my first draw, very smooth. Obviously, it's got that rich creaminess, dark, a little bit of a sweet tone. Right. Sweet note in there. Yeah, I got some wood, got some leather. Some on the description on a lot of websites, it says cashews. I don't quite taste any cashews quite yet, but it has that tea flavor though. Mm -hmm. You said that. Yeah, that's like why a, you get the Arizona. Like an herbal, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like it has like a tea. It's so nice. Whew. Yeah, we haven't smoked the Kintsugi in a while. Even off the retro hell, got a very uh, little bit of spice, a little bit of pepper. Not that much off the retro hell, but still very, very delicious. This will be a very, very good cigar for someone who's just starting out and they want to get into. Uh, some darker or stronger, stronger body cigars. I think this would be a great segue to get in from the mild to medium, and this being a, a medium cigar. This is a full medium. Yeah, this just... guy's got a beautiful flat ring. I got a, mine's kind of a canoeing a little bit. White as the snow, very white. Well, let's get into this first third, see what this middle third brings us, and stay tuned and we'll be back. The sweetness is gone. Uh, the sweet note in the beginning for me is a little bit gone. But yeah, it feels like it's getting, it's still smooth. It's getting darker and darker. Uh, I kind of start to taste the, the dark chocolate off it. Like a very nice, rich, dark chocolate. Some of the flavors I'm tasting right now is toasted bread, maybe toasted peanuts. Roasted nuts or like cashew. Exactly. Dark chocolate, coffee beans, some kind of coffee or roasted coffee. Oh yeah. Toasted ground coffee. All right, time to take the band off. I like this band because it, it's two in one. Oh, you make that look. Look at that hand. So the and signifies Alec and Bradley, not to confuse with Alec Bradley, which is obviously the parent company that the father built. See that right there? The construction is very nice. It's, the draw has been very consistent. We have a size gorda right now, so the gauge is huge. All that we're getting, the, the smoke that we're getting is very uh, good amount. Six, six by 60 is the correct measurement. And obviously with the gorda, a little bit big, uh, bigger ring gauge, you get a nice, really nice draw. No complaints. Yeah, people like us that who likes a lot of smoke, on our poles, it's a very good size, the Gordo. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. That's right, mm -mm. Uh, Let's talk about the strength for a little bit, getting a little bit more full, medium to fuller body. But like I said in the beginning, I think it is a very good segue cigar to trying uh, stronger and full body cigars. How do you think? What do you think? I think the same thing. Like I think people will get tricked by the how smooth and creaminess it is, um, but don't get tricked, because the strength is there, definitely. Getting a light buzz from it. And as for the flavors, I think uh, a lot of the flavors are pretty consistent throughout. You know, some of the, uh, you know, like I said, toasted bread. Uh, there's a little bit of you know, cashews. I think I taste a little bit of that mineral flavor you taste in some of the distilled water or like triple filtered waters, like Dasani and things like that. The sweetness is definitely gone. Mm -hmm. right? like, and throughout the whole cigar, whole stogie, you know, no problems. You didn't have to touch it, light it. Yeah. Burn has been pretty uh, consistent throughout. Right now, I am down to four Kintsugis, unfortunately. I have been smoking the shit out of my cigar. I have not re-upped in a, quite a bit of time. Unfortunately, I was sick the last uh, week and a half. Just getting over it. Fear not, we are both double vaccinated. Officially as of today. 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 But yeah, we are staying safe. Mm -hmm. But our smoking time has been about, it's been about an hour now. We're just going into the last third. Almost enough. This is one of those stogies that you want to have. You want to have a toothpick or something, right? Pick it till the end. Smoke it till the end. Cause it's so consistent. Tito Puente. Woo. Presentation and label. The draw. The construction. The flavor. The strength and overall performance. 
What is your final score for the Alec and Bradley Kintsugi Gordo? <laughs> My score for the Kintsugi Gordo will have to go be 95. Woo -hoo -hoo! I know it's pretty high, but this one deserves a 95 out of 100. Can't go wrong. I, like, I don't even need a drink to pair with it, you know what I mean? Like it's, if you're a boss man, you'll pair with water. Mm -hmm. But you got the Sani. Already some minerals in here. Don't even know the Sani. Got some McDonald's coffee. It's coffee in here. You don't even know coffee. Mm. So my score was 95. How about yours? All right, so here we go. Boom. A 93 out of Woo! 100. So 93, that's pretty high still. Both very high scores. 94 average between the two of us. But is this box worthy? Box worthy? Definitely box worthy. But yes, this has been another review by yours truly, Say and Tito, your Stogie homies. Thank you for watching. It has been a pleasure. It's been a beautiful day. It's hot as fucking darn on today. But we still came out and gave you a homies review. Got our new setup. Hope you guys like the new setup. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button. Hit the bell button. Comment whatever the hell you want. Catch you in the next video. Holla.